<laughs> so we see where J3 is, honorary treasurer and controversial chief starter, Mr. Ludlow Watts, has come out swinging at the media <laughs> after taking some serious licks in that Daniel Williams disqualification controversy. Listen to Mr. Watts, a punch like a boxer on the ropes. Listen. Let the media people come and have a discussion with us, but instead of being ignorant and uninformed, they create mayhem and they're part of the major problems we have in Jamaica in terms of track and field and in terms of officiating. They are doing a disservice to the public and to the track and field people. <laughs> well, honey, it's who Mr. Watts a job for a to say that the starter has a discretionary power and can raise a green flag and put any athlete back in any race, especially at a national chance to pick the best athletes to represent the country. That is mayhem, Mr. Watts. <laughs> when we saw with our own two eyes Usain Bolt and Veronica Campbell Brown blatantly fall start and were put back in the race, was that mayhem or was that common sense, Mr. Watts? <laughs> It is this stupid one false start rule, and people like you who are slaves to this foolishness is who will cause the mayhem. <laughs> and speaking of mayhem, so Mr. Watts, if Shelly and Fraser Price comes to the national trials this year and twitch in the blocks, you're going to use your discretion or you're going to fling her out of the ring. <laughs> <laughs> if Mr. Watts, if it's not that you don't see mayhem, yes, it's not that you don't see mayhem. <laughs>